Hey guys, it's Kraus. Welcome back everybody to Foundation. Just sit back, relax and enjoy. So ladies and gentlemen, in the previous episode of Foundation, we set off to build a castle and deep inside, I think I like it. Uh, I think I do. However, yesterday I've spent three hours and I kid you not, I spent three hours just sitting here waiting for them to complete the castle wall. And are they done? No, mm -mm. no, 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 mm -mm. no, 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 mm -mm. no, 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 no. But I, I, I just can't be bothered anymore. Like I think it looks semi decent and finished. I did uh, complete it on this side, so it looks something like so. And I guess to some, this might just be a big mess of structures and such. But to me, it's more than that. Nah, it's pretty much just a big mess of structures and such. But it doesn't have a purpose. It doesn't. It's a castle. Just leave Kiralas alone. And this monastery bridge. Well, they ain't gonna finish that. Never. Uh, I've tried so many different combinations and it's so killing me on the inside. But we just have to pretend that it's supposed to look like so. But it looks like so. And my OCD is gonna kill me. I'm gonna cry. Ooh, hello, sir. Whereabouts? Hi. Can I talk to this guy? Yes, I can. War is coming. War never changes. Uh, we are prepared and will. Actually, we are not that prepared. <laughs> and would be happy to have some helping hands. Ideally with swords or axes. How about sending some of your troops to our aid? I don't really have any troops at this stage. But I guess this is the purpose of the envoy. He comes and asks us for troops. So that is something we're going to do later on in this episode. Because at this stage I don't have any troops. I will get 1000 gold. 20 wine i believe that is uh 10 or more standing with the kingdom and one free territory send five soldiers to see the name okay you know what we're gonna do that later on envoy thank you so much for visiting us but um what was i saying oh yeah so yesterday when i was sitting and waiting for them to complete the wall i did start a little expansion job and that is something i think we're gonna do in today's episode maybe even add maybe even at a village somewhere about. But I did start expanding on this side of the map and mainly just adding a few extra houses, some sheep farms and then wheat farms. So I think we've pretty much stabilized the bread production uh, in the village or in the kingdom. However, close, man, close. And by the way, this game is absolutely, I don't know, it's just adorable, welcoming and just warm. I like it. I like it so much. Yeah, like one issue is close and I have no idea how to fix that. Maybe I'm doing something just wrong terribly wrong so yesterday what i did i for example i did uh, uh, build more tailor workshops and weaver huts but i did kick people from their houses like i built a house over here and assigned those shepherds to live in that house and the weavers they live in that house and so on and so on but it does not seem to be helping that much like i guess we might be just using too much clothes or something is messed up i don't know We'll, we'll give it a go today's episode to fix that situation. I've been fixing that for like five episodes, but we'll see, okay? But uh, what I also want to do is this. Uh, I want to go into Kingdom and I'm going to unlock myself the Hunter Sat later on. So we could do, we can maybe make a little Hunter Village of some type. Should we click it? And to get the Weaponsmith, we require 40 Splendor. How the crap is one supposed to get that? Because... Obviously, like, all those towers we've got, they've added to the splendor of the kingdom, right? And let me just see here. The wooden keep. So the core building is free splendor. The tops are 1. Doors, 0 0.1. Wooden gate, 0 0.1. Uh, flag, 0 0.2. So we could be just spamming flags all over the place. And the training dummies. I want to I check this out later on as well. Okay. It is what it is. But first things first. So the town, or this town, is going to be expanded to this side of, of the... Of the of the island as well so we're gonna do that later on but I was, I was thinking about this mountaintop i've actually bought a territory here yesterday and i'm thinking like it will look super awesome just having something up here on this mountaintop maybe even like a little like yeah a hunting village of some type and then maybe having the wheat farms on the on the on the on the hill here or even sheep farms is you know what we'll see cash is not in our favor however but then again it's kind of rarely in our favor because uh, what i want to do is buy one more tire let me just see territories so this is mine this is mine this is mine i kind of want to buy this can we reach 500 pause the game boom we got it so what do we do pretty much same same but a little bit different uh, we're gonna need a rusty church a well and a marketplace right uh, let's go rusty church and uh, let's go with a dark one maybe Corby or Core? Let's just use the normal core, like so. In the back, we're gonna have an extension B. 
Because that is what we're all about. Uh, can I just align this correctly? Perfect. Bring it up a little bit. Not too shabby, I would say. Then, um, as goes for towers, we've used... Maybe not that one, maybe just the unnamed part. Just on the side somewhere about, like so. Okay, don't judge this yet. This is still a work in progress. <laughs> okay, this might actually work. Can I bring this down again? Perfect. Okay, something like so. That is not too shabby whatsoever. And then we can have the door entrance, uh, maybe a door A, here on the tower part. Boom. Shakalak. Okay, that works. And then, you know me, this might be a little bit boring to, 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 to have, but I'm just going to add this just so we can have the capacity increased a little bit because this just holds, what is it, 20, right? So if we get this guy, we should be fine. And then just a little tower. Something like so, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, shabby? Eh, uh, no. Elevation-wise, just perfect. Kind of looks like a little bit of a monastery up here on the on the on the mountain top. Perfect. Then let's go for before we uh, construct that. Let's go for a market. So what do we need? I'm actually I'm actually thinking like if the if the if the if the hunter. It's gonna be one more food source because if that is the case then we would need four food markets because it's gonna be bread fish berries and uh, i don't know hun hunter meat uh not meat from the hunters because we're not gonna kill hunters we need one goods and we need one luxurious at least two luxurious would be the better uh, uh, choice but uh let's just go one this is gonna be the little hunter village who do we help nobody but let's do this and then have a well just like so here in the middle and everybody's gonna be super happy boom done it so hopefully gonna build, build up that um let's uh, should we by the way did we choose the darker color yes we did start construction on that start construction on this and this is gonna be started so what else do we need well obviously zone out a little bit residential zones hi trader we would need the, the desirability should change as soon as we get stuff up and running so let's you know what let's keep the force intact Let's surround it something like so, and then just in the back stages. And then, let me just see this. Uh, now that we got some cash, can I check out the Hunter's Hut? How does this even look? Um, what is that? Does it, there's like deer heads. Is that deer? Maybe it's deer. Kind of looks like uh, Bambis. So we're going to be killing Bambis left and right. So let's add... As soon as we get some cash, uh, let's add, there's an the door entrance, let's add on the side, on the back, no, you know what, let's just do here. It's gonna be a village, we're gonna have a church, behind the church we're gonna have the killing fields. One, and maybe just two next to each other, just to kind of see how they operate. And then I think we need to assign a hunting zone. So, do you guys think they will be hunting inside of the forest? I guess I haven't... The thing about that is that I haven't seen any deers in the game. Maybe maybe this doesn't work yet. What, but why, why would they add the hunters if it doesn't work? Oh, obviously it's gonna work. Something like so. Maybe even extend that a little bit further. To about, about here. Perfect. This is gonna be a huge hunting zone. Yeah, I haven't really seen any deer. Hmm. In a tail west thing. But let them build that up. As you can see... It's far, far away in the galaxy, so it's going to take absolutely forever for the villagers to bring stuff to this place. But we have one, two, three, four, five, six houses on this side. Why nobody in the back? Uh, where the crap's all my builders? Oh, crap, maybe I don't have any builders. A job? Do you even job? Nope, we should be having tons of builders. Yeah. A lot of them are unhappy. And this is what I mean. Hopefully, as soon as we change the situation around for those guys, like with housing, because uh, with housing will come uh, food because of the markets in the vicinity. We will also have some, uh, what are you going to call it, a well, and then we have the churches. So if, when their happiness goes up, maybe that's going to change stuff around. Lady, you're beautiful, but you're definitely not a builder. Where's the builders at? Here they come. No, that's the fishermen. The Maria Maria and Jesus. I want to add myself a, a forester camp. You might be like, but why Kerala's? You know what I think I could do is maybe even uh, plant some trees all, all the way around here. Just to make it look really nice. And then on the slope here, either have uh, sheep farms or wheat farms. Bread is not an issue. Close, however, 
is a whole different story. 60 people with their ding-dongs and hoo-hahs flapping about. Still scaring the kids. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 houses. There is 24 people. That's gonna house in case they move in to together. Because some people don't do that. Some people just live like uh, a single life. The bachelor life and whatnot. <laughs> this looks kind of cool having him and the beautiful town in the background with all the towers, the monastery, the, the castle. That looks nice. Okay, chop chop. Get to it. Ladies and gentlemen, where's the builders at? Oh yeah! So they're flooding in in masses now. So we have builders all over the place. New people arriving in the community and uh, I'm gonna spare you from, from watching them, them build all this because that's gonna take a while. But then again, how amazing doesn't this look? Just seeing the town in the background, like just, just seeing all these things we've built. It's amazing! It's amazing! It's a me, Mario! I didn't even see that it's got a little bucket here as well. It's just the small things. Maybe it goes up and down. I, I, I don't know. But there's stuff. Stuff is going down. I'm actually going to prioritize those as well. Because I want to see this up and running. It does produce... Well, hides. I would say hides and, and meat. Well, hopefully meat. Let me just see here. If I go into a, a market which is already built up. Can I change the food resource over here? I can! Okay, so it is deer. So we have the berries, the bread, and deer. Interesting. The thing about this is, like, do we need all the food, uh, four food sources uh, in every single, like, market region? Or can we just maybe remove fish from this one and add deer instead? Well, I guess it's a vote at high. Let's see here, that's bread. Let's not touch that. Uh, okay, let's change berries to deer. But, you might, but, but we don't have any deer. Hey, hey, hey. We will eventually. Two people just joined the community and they're gonna become hunters. Who do we help? Um, what, do you, what, what do you want? Okay, you know what? Do we need... Do we, I don't need points in anything. I'm not giving away my, my, my stuff. Ooh, the first house is up over here as well. And the church is coming along very nicely. So, question is, what do we have here on the slope? I would say, I would say sheep farms. Combine that with some uh, with some uh, with some uh, wheat farms, because I think that's gonna look really nice. However, can okay, we need to rotate them so they don't really stick up so much from the ground? But uh, so they don't float. Let's do one over here. As, uh, Okay, maybe... Are we floating? I don't think we are. One over here. And one just just like so. You might be like, but that is terrible. No, no, no. Because then, as soon as this guy is built up, the forester, we're going to assign nice, like, forest patches. So we're going to hide away a little bit in the between areas. And then maybe just add the, 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 the wheat farm. Somewhere in this vicinity as well. Um, yeah, it's going to be a little bit floaty, however. That is the only problem. Maybe, like, here... Should one be enough? One farm to rule them all? Uh, I don't think so. Maybe even one over here. Or, or here. Are we floating? Well, it's gonna be a pain in the nuggets to get in and out of from this house. But do we care about this? No, we don't. Poop it down. So one and two farms, maybe one here in the backstage as well. Boom! And then have like a beautiful patch of, of wheat here combined with the, with the, with the sheep. It's going to be very lively in, in, the, in the area of here. Okay, so it's definitely coming along. We just need more houses to, to make more people happy. 76 people naked. It just go, keeps going up. Likes. It's all in the bush. It's all in the bush. Like, uh, game devs. I love you to bits, but could you add more bushes to the game? That would mean uh, the world to me. Like, even like a little, like, bushy hedge. Like, just something simple. So we have, because now, there's a lot of same, same, but just a little bit different. Okay, how do we go? This is not wheelchair friendly. What's up? This is a little house over here. So that is bad news. Okay, stuff like this is going to kill me on the inside. But it's not over until the fat lady sings. So what we could do is just this. 
we just get a little small wall and then just drag the wall like like this maybe even extend this a little bit like so add some bushes and trees and it's not gonna be as visible as as just the, the, the big floatiness right because look at this looky looky at my cookie and a little few of those i wish those snap to the ground level but uh it doesn't really matter the trees do but having two of those next to each other no 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 boom difference it's got to be a little bit different then i guess like and this is something we could put around Aversnil farm like having those stone walls like uh, they do have quite a bit of that in europe right like just just those old like uh, stone walls around farm areas and stuff not sure how that would look uh we can we can try we can give it a little go over here just to kind of see how that would look not sure we're gonna keep it but uh it would look something like so and then yeah just surrounding the whole the whole farms themselves it's gonna be a lot of wall if that's gonna be a thing i ain't giving up my bread even though the bread is going down again is that just because we got so much more people i think that might be the case but yeah i'm gonna be decorating here a little bit uh, and those hunters are already up. They are up. They are up and running. Do we have any people to assign to this? Uh, pretty much no. Okay. I think I saw somebody. Is that my hunter? Uh, I think so. Okay. She looks at a, at a tree. She might be hunting squirrels up in a tree. Okay. Just so you guys know. That might be a thing. Okay, she comes back. She goes back into the, the hunting uh, lodge. And she brought back a letter. Uh, one letter, so it's letter hide, I guess. And one deer. Okay, so hopefully that deer is going to be traded in the market over here. But yeah, let me just decorate this for a moment. And I'm going to be back as soon as I can, ladies and gentlemen. We still have a crap ton of people homeless. 19 still people naked all over the place it's it's bad overall it's bad but i guess as long as long as they get bushes around i mean would i complain uh, nah i would be I, I would be happy i would be content in my life it's taking shape i would say uh, it is not as I envisioned my face. It looks much better in my face, but uh, it is something, I guess, and it's fully operational. I'm thinking, can I just add, can I add a little wall here? I'm getting all wall crazy now. But uh, sheep, move away, because a wall is being constructed as we speak. Yeah, this is not too, too shabby. So this just goes up here, and they can just continue. I don't know we'll see but uh, it is definitely taking shape oh one thing which we need is a windmill so let's get a windmill set up uh windmill okay i know th this is nothing we need to do but i need to align them correctly that is aligned correctly perfect i know it's, you know th yeah and I, I guess it doesn't really matter but to me it does so there's gonna be a little windmill we could maybe even squeeze in some fisher hats over here because more people are gonna be joining right and maybe like hey here maybe Okay, let's just add one to begin with. And we'll see how, how that turns out. A house is upgrading, and that is amazing. Zzz, those sheep farms. Let me just see here. You guys producing wool. Perfect. So we would need a weaver hut somewhere. Like so. I'm going to be blocking the view for the peeps a little bit. But they will just have to deal with that. Uh, I am the captain now. Uh, I am the captain. I am totally the captain. And I guess we could just add this guy just off this town square. Uh, doesn't have to be straight doesn't have to be super pretty as long as it looks a little bit organic that's gonna be amazing so one more weaver hut one more tailor is there anything else we need i guess we're gonna be expanding maybe even this way but let's just build up this uh, how about the residential zone still have a little bit of space here in the back so one and two houses being built up problem is it, this is not going to be enough. Like, we build a whole village to house, uh, house more people, but more people are joining. We have 367 people in the community and, and growing. Yeah, this whole, this whole place is huge. It's not that huge. It's huge. So the plan is, like, 
obviously this 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 series in this content update is going to be ending maybe even in the next episode but what i want to do is surround this with more villages um i can have like a big building episode in the, in the next one like just just doing tons of camera work and then see how this look that, that looks uh, this castle wall is going to be obviously uh, connected and all the houses within the town is going to be going to be constructed as well and then yeah just having like villages and farms around this i do like this as we did like having like all the houses and then the fields in the back i like that i like that qu quite a bit but um you guys get get to this uh, and while they're going to do that i'm gonna move into the keeps i do wanna assign okay let's do let's do this uh keep 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 looking for a good time uh, edit let's just jump down here let's maybe add is on a wooden gate you might be like what is going on i'm not sure this is going to be a thing but if i align that nicely like so maybe uh yeah 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 yeah, yeah. and then having okay wall crazy don't don't judge me what i want to do is like it's not a small training ground for those uh, for those soldiers and i'm not even sure they're going to be using the training dummies if they are a game changer if not well it is what it is okay so something like this and uh, let's start a construction no 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 edit uh training dummies and maybe just put a few of those just to kind of test it out let's have like let me see are they correctly aligned i guess the targets should be on the front right so let's have one and two here. It would be so awesome if they would be using this. Uh, let's have one here. And one going to be a tight squeeze over here. But it will work. Boom. So let's have those. Uh, let's start the construction. How much does this cost? Five uh, planks? That's kind of cheap. Boom. Oh, okay. So the only thing they need to build up is this little uh, gate thingy. But this is already done in a training court. Fantastic. Okay. So how about this? Let's assign... Do we have any spare villagers? Uh, job? Do you even job? Yeah, we have quite plenty of peeps. Let's assign one, two, three, four, and five to this. Might be an overkill, however. We're gonna have five on this keep. Uh, then we're gonna have maybe like one and two uh, one and two because that's kind of like the door entrances and we can edit them as well not with like uh, amazing stuff just maybe like a one or two training dummies hereabouts they're merging into one and they move the same as well but will you guys use this waiting for a builder please hurry up I guess all my builders are currently occupied uh, in this section of, of the town, or the kingdom. What was that all about? Did you guys see them just going like around here? What is that all about? Uh, am I blocking you guys somehow? Is something blocking you? That is, that is, that is kind of neat, uh, I guess. Maybe something is up with this. Let's just adjust it a little bit. I kind of thought the walls didn't interfere with people's movement. But but maybe it does. Or maybe it's just the trees over here. Because they're planting quite, 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 quite a bit of those. Oh, by the way, how's the hunters doing? Probably it's going to be the ladder. Because I don't think there's anything in the game as, as, as of now which uses the ladder. So we're going to have a lot of ladder to spare. And how about the market? Is anybody buying... Nobody is buying the, the deer. You know, like deer. Uh, maybe in this one. Uh, maybe this one. Nope. No deer is being carried to this place. A house is upgrading. Well, that's that's good news, I guess. You guys. Oh, okay. The beautiful gate is being constructed in front of our eyes. Still, nobody's used the the the, the practice dummies. So maybe this is just for for show, but it looks so neat just having a lot of them get those guys. Maybe we should go. Okay, just keep. Let's fire like one and two, and I guess we're gonna be spreading the love. So we're gonna add one and two on this guy, 
let's add maybe one and two on this guy does that cost me yeah, the question is if that costs me what are you gonna call it um gold for upkeeping keep, the soldiers because that might be a thing they might actually cost me me upkeep oh stop it you gotta be kidding me it does work or maybe not i mean he had a sword right you guys saw that so he came and and punched the training dummy i think yeah, look at this okay this is incredible look at this little adorable guys just punching this okay let's just play like uh one speed <laughs> this is awesome and those sideburns man you beautiful face. Yeah, yeah. Give it to it. That sounds wrong. This is amazing. Nobody's using... Yeah, they are! Okay. Stuff is going down in the training yards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just change. <laughs> Man, this is so sweet. Okay, I like this. Now it's just waiting for a freaking envoy to arrive. War is coming. I've read this before. Okay, I'm gonna deploy my troops right away. So that means you have a new quest. Uh, what is this? Start mission setup? Well, okay, wait, okay, okay. Slow this down a little bit. What is even this? Start mission or pen mission? I don't know what this is. But we do have the people over here. So the, obviously they're training. I'm going to click this. Oh, I can assign people. Okay. I can assign. Yeah. Send them. So soldiers are regrouping. Where are those guys regrouping? I want to see this regrouping situation going. Is this the guys? Is you regrouping? Are you leaving in combat? What a sad day. No, it's not. Hopefully they're going to come back uh, alive and thriving. It's gotta be those guys, because they've been standing here forever. And I think there's like five guys. Uh, they merge inside of one guy. People join the community. F fabulous. We do have a situation with pretty much everything. Uh, yeah. We might be just too expensive too, too, too rapidly. Yeah. I think immigration is bad news for us at this stage. But we kind of need more people to kind of fill up all the job possibilities over here. But I guess there's less builders and that's going to kind of fix the issue for us. We will see. Uh, how is this going with the vault over here? Let me get that in. That goes to about here. Why is nobody? Why is nobody using my beautiful paths over here? It does not matter. No, it doesn't. They still seem happy, and if they're happy, then I'm happy. But yeah, today's episode was actually fun for me to play, instead of just waiting for people to build up stuff, uh, which takes forever. Uh, let's assign. Boom, boom. And what did I say? We're going to have iron ore, uh, more iron ore, and we're going to have a plenty of um, coal. So iron ore and coal in this warehouse and two people assigned. Perfect. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> oh man, I like those guys. Pretty darn interesting. Um, but yeah, so thank you so much for watching today's episode. Uh, next episode might be the last one in this content update. But I'm going to do as much as I can in the next episode. We're going to kind of fill up this area, hopefully, with some villages and stuff. And then surround maybe this with a wall and uh, see how much people can get. We have 387, hoping about 500 would be, be kind of cool to, to get. And that should not be impossible. But um, I'm happy with this place. It's my little happy place. Indeed. Oh, an envoy. So, sir, talk to me. No. Oh, he talked and, and I cl this, they clicked. Sorry, sir. Uh, bye. Next time I will try to send. If anybody knows how to send the soldiers, please do let me know in the comment section. Because 
they're gonna die otherwise they just be standing here and there's no failure condition so they will be standing here for literally forever but and i want a thousand gold the 20 wine and i do want my free territory as well so let me know if you guys know how to obtain uh, or start that little mission but uh, what goes for this thank you so 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 much for watching i'm Kiralis. let's just finalize this on a beautiful shot of the of the castle again like so yeah yeah, yeah. see you guys in the next one Kiralis over now bye bye